What's up, YouTube? We're back. We got another Hack Clubs Pickups video. This is uh, part 18, uh, the second this week. Uh, that'll be it, though, from here. But uh, just as I said in the previous video, uh, Canada Post fucking sucks. Uh, let's get right into it. Not going to waste any of y'all's time. Let's start with the peanut butter and jam collection that came out on Cyber Monday. They were. I was assuming there was no special pin, so I was assuming they would send just the regular, regular like Hack Club exclusive pin. But they actually sent me um, a candy pin from the candy pack. Uh, which is kind of funny. So I feel like this was intentional. They said it wasn't, but I think it was because I seen some of the people on Twitter having the same uh, kind of special delivery. But I believe this was, this was what was supposed to happen with it. But it was pretty cool. I picked up the Los Angeles Angels logo, California Angels, whatever. Um, I actually wanted this logo so bad. Just the entire like detail of this hat is, is honestly great. The Angels logo has an orange outline with the black A, and then it's got like this magenta. Um, kind of halo there, which is really cool. Um, the top of the brim is in like a very light brown, which I really like this brown. I haven't seen this on a hackway yet, so it's really nice. And it's got this really light khaki color um, on the rest of the hat of the upper, uh, which is really nice. Um, the patch, I might have this one already from the NHL uh, MLB drop, um, but this one is the California Angels 1961 to 1995 35th anniversary. It's got orange, black, magenta, white, all in this patch, uh, it's fantastic, I really like that. And then the batter man is really nice, got white, magenta, and orange, so that's really nice as well. Man, they went crazy on this, they got a magenta UV and white guts, so white guts could get dirty, but you know what, I ain't complaining, the white looks really good with this, I think it was the right call. 100% polyester, made in China, um, and my size is 734, so you don't know already, but let's check the fit on this one. The fit on this one is really good. I did uh, stretch it a little bit just to make it a little bit better, but this one is really nice. Uh, you can't go wrong with this. I love the colors, it looks so nice. This is like a pretty good fall hat with some pop. Uh, can't go wrong with that. Here's a side profile if you're wondering. Uh, just a really nice hat, peanut butter and jam, baby. Who doesn't love that? All right, so next up, obviously like the biggest part of the video, the Black Dome Collection made a return. I believe it came out last year in 2020 toward the latter half. Um, it came out as obviously the black domes are just pretty much it's a standard collection It's it's pretty much all black uh, Predominant hats with white guts, but it has like like the logos that they okay The teams that they use like pretty much are like fixed to a certain era of the logo the patch Like they keep it very in sync, which is really nice. They didn't make a special pin last time, but this one is really cool It's pretty much a fucking turtle uh, for, like it's it's so fucking cool. I, like, it's got like kind of the the shell in this white uh, print, which is really cool. But let's get into the hats. I'm sure you're wondering. Um, so I picked up first the Florida Marlins, like the the actual Marlin, which is really nice. Uh, kind of a debate when it came to these hats, and this one was the one I wasn't sure about, but I ended up getting it anyways. Uh, the other hat was one I really wanted to to get, which I'll show you in a bit. It's pretty much the entire hat is black blacked out uh, the button as well. Um, the Florida Marlins logo, uh, it's got this like silver glitter inside. Great logo, really nice. Uh, the New Era logo is in black, which is nice as well. Uh, the patch is inaugural year, 1993, uh, pretty much of the Florida Marlins when I guess they were added to, to the um, MLB. The Marlins in uh, the same, the, the glitter, a lot of glitter here, uh, again with the silver glitter. Teal, white, black outlines, as you can see. And then the Batterman is in this teal, black, and white. It's standard white guts, green UV, which is super nice. Got Cooper's Down Collection, New Era, 100% polyester made in China, 734s, obviously. Let's check the fit on this one. Uh, yeah, the fit's not great on this one. Uh, not so good. I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, when I tried these on beforehand, the black dome sizing is not good. Uh, um, just definitely a warning guys, uh, at least for the ones I got and the way my head is. My head is pretty big, so. But yeah, this one, uh, in terms of like the hat, it looks great. I did stretch it a bit, so it is much better. I, I'm gonna stretch it again, I think, but uh, it is just a really nice hat. Uh, the details are crazy on this one. A little loud, obviously, because it's big, but I think it's uh, super nice. Uh, regardless and very clean you can wear this with a lot of things and uh, that teal is super nice and the other black dome I got the last hat today um, is one that was highly sought after the Seattle Mariners dude I've been trying to get this logo forever this is like when Ken Griffey first got to the Mariners I've been trying to get this logo in so many different types of 
types of collections and stuff. Um, finally have it. I went for actually the Sn uh, Snickers Canada candy pack. Never ended up getting it, but I got this one now. Uh, like obviously the other hat, obviously black button, black tired hat. Um, the logo is in that same uh, same true to form yellow and a little bit of a black outline in that blue. In this patch, I really wanted this one for a while. I know a lot of people said they're a little bit sick of it, but I don't have it, so I'm really happy to have it. It's the 40th anniversary of the Seattle Mariners, 1977 to 2017. And the Batterman is blue, yellow, and white. So you can't go wrong with that. And then the white guts, and then the green UV, obviously Cooper's Island collection, 100% uh, polyester made in China, and seven three-fourths. So super nice as well. Keep it simple, let's check the fit on this one. All right, so the fit is better on this one, okay? It was uh, similar to the Florida Myers. I stretched it, it's a lot better now. I really like it, um, but I might stretch it again just to make an even more comfortable fit, but I don't necessarily need it, but um, it is really nice. I really like this logo, it's super nice. I can show you the side profile, just of how it looks and stuff. I just, uh, I love this one, this is uh, fantastic. But yeah, guys, that's all the hats I got from the collections. I got obviously the Black Domes, the PB and J. Uh, let me know down below if you got anything from these and rate my pickups as well. Uh, did you get lucky with these? Let me know your sizing on the Black Domes. I'm kind of curious. Do you have the same sort of tune as me and stuff? And uh, were you happy with your hats, of course? And did you try to cop, obviously, these? It's been a lot easier at Hat Club lately. Um, you could tell they really bump stock up and stuff. And uh, always, always a great thing to see as the fit of game grows. So that uh, they're finally able to catch up with kind of what people want, right? So but anyways, guys, thank you for watching. If you made it to this point in the video, if you even consider leaving a like, commenting, subscribing, and turn that post notification bell down below as well. It helps us a ton here on the channel. And honestly, dude, like it helps us with engagement. If you want to see more videos like this, uh, we keep having them and stuff. We obviously have two this week. We might have one next week or worst case the week after. I did buy some things from the Badlands and the Cyberpunks collection. So whenever those come in, um, I'll do those. Oh, and the NFL White Thumbs as well. So you get videos on that whenever they come in. Yeah, guys, let me know down below what you thought of everything and you take care. But anyways, guys, that's a wrap for Hack Club Pickups Part 19, the Black Dome Collection and the Peanut Butter and Jam PB&J Pack. Later.